Good morning, Junior 4. Today we are going to explain lesson 1 in chapter 11, which is called Show Me the Data. In this chapter, we are going to talk about creating and analyzing graph. Here, if I have in the first question, this shape of graph, which is called line plot. The other one, this one called double bar graph. And this one is the bar graph or single bar graph. Okay. The question here is, which graph doesn't belong and why? Here in this line plot is talking about number of animals at home. Here, how many people doesn't have animals at home? One, two, three, four, five. How many have? Three. How many have one animal, three, and so on. The number of axes represent one student. Here, it's talking about favorite farm animals. The dogs, how many for the boys, four, how many for the girls, five. Here is my key. And here, this graph, it's talking about rabbits, types of animals. We have at home rabbits, they are four, dogs, they are eight, cats, they are 11, goldfish, they are 6, and tortoise, they are 5. Okay, so which one doesn't belong? Which is the farm, favorite farm animals? Because here it's talking about the number of animals at home, and here's the kind of animals we have at home. Go to the other page, page 117, here. Here he is asking, could this data be represented in a double bar graph? The answer will be yes. Why? Because we are comparing between maximum and minimum temperature in each month. Here in this, could this data be represented in double bar graph? The answer would be no, because we are not comparing between two sports. Turn on the page, page 118. This table here, could this data be represented in a double bar graph? The answer would be yes, because we are comparing favorite food between boys and girls.